In this video, I'm going to share you how to represent the information in the form of networks. Example 15. This example I take from KSSM Mathematics Telephone 4 textbook page 144. The table below shows the data of six pupils and the games that they like. Represent the information in the form of a network. Name of pupil, Edmund likes to play badminton and chess. Azwan likes to play football and sepak takro. Rajan, chess and football. Aina, chess and netball. Maria, badminton and netball. And Jenny, netball and volleyball. Based on the table between type of game and name of pupils, which group will you use to represent the vertices? According to the table, the type of game is more suitable to represent the vertices because more than one pupils like to play each type of game. So now, how many games are there? Badminton, chess, football, sepak takro, netball, and volleyball. We have six games. Means we need to draw six vertices representing all the games. Okay, we start from Edmund. Badminton and chess. So I draw the line from badminton to chess and I label it, label the edge at man. Azwan likes to play football and sepak takro. I draw a line from football to sepak takro and I label the edge Azwan. Rajan likes to play chess and football. So connect the point chess to football. And label it Rajan. Aina likes to play chess and netball. So draw a line from chess to netball. And label it Aina. Maria likes to play badminton and netball. So we draw the line from badminton to netball and label it Maria. Last one, Jenny likes to play netball and volleyball. So draw a line from netball to volleyball and label it as Jenny. So this is a simple undirected graph. Okay, maybe some of the students will ask, teacher, how about I uh, write the vertices uh, from where? Yeah, it's okay. Let's say if I draw the vertices like this, we start from Edmund, badminton and chess. Then we label it at man. As one football, sepak takro. So from football to sepak takro, I draw the line. Rajan, chess, football. So I connect two vertices, chess and football. And label it Rajan. Next is Aina likes to play chess and netball. So from chess to netball. Maria, badminton, netball. So from badminton to netball. And I label it Maria. The last one, Jenny, netball and volleyball. So from netball to volleyball, I draw the line and label it as Jenny. 
this is how we represent the information in the form of network. If you like my video, please feel free to like and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Thank you.